Hello Pyromaniacs and welcome to Drawn to Death. This is a game with quite unique art style as you can see on the screen. It is a four player maximum multiplayer uh, arena shooter which is pretty cool and uh, you have a series of funky characters and some interesting weapons to play around with. There are several game modes. We are going into a brawl here so this is a round based uh, system and each uh, every time someone kills someone they win the round and then you move on to the, to the next round. Uh, there is the deathmatch and the team deathmatch you know what those are and then there is an organ donor mode which is uh, basically you've got to collect uh, body parts hearts and different organs and then deposit it in a special area now I think the best part about this game is the level designs and the arenas that you actually play in because there's a lot of moving elements a lot of um, platforms and stuff and now we are going into the game we're just playing against one person this brings us to the, another point it's incredibly hard right now to find actual matches and not a whole lot of people seem to be uh, on I guess I guess there's a lot of people on but uh, it is taking a while to get a match I took over 20 minutes to get this one believe it um so let's go we're gonna have to shoot here uh, as you can see um uh, he might be new as well i'm new as well and i kind of suck at this as you might be able to tell whoa i i think i threw something yeah i just got seven percent health and now i have no percent health let's go into him and yeah this guy actually explodes when he dies so yeah cool i lose and now we're gonna do a new round so yeah, that's the game so far. These are some of the weapons. They're the ones on the left side you spawn with and the ones on the right side you um, put on the battlefield so you can pick those up. Uh, and as you can see, yeah, I do suck at this. Uh, we're gonna, you know, try. Uh, each character has a special uh, ability or two. Uh, he just spawned over there. Um, how do we do this thing? How do we, how, how, yes. <laughs> yep, I tried to do that. It wasn't successful. He is doing his now, um, his special ability. I'm not sure what the heck's happening there. Um, but let's equip our weapon again. There he is. There he is. Come on. Come on. There's no fall damage. Um, I don't think there is. I don't think so. Yeah. Uh, we're barely hitting him. So yeah, it takes some learning. It does take some learning. And my weapon is out of ammo and I have exploded once again. Did I say I suck at this? Yeah, because I do. I haven't, I've, I've tried to play multiple times. I've just given up because it was loading for 10-15 minutes. And not actually getting an online match. So that was a bit of a problem. But anyhow. I'm gonna throw you loose at this and here we go let's just land right here and try to shoot this guy in the face I'll try to show off uh, some of this guy's special ability each character has their own special ability this one here he kind of fills up that bar and then and then and then yeah he does this thing where he just fires a whole lot of things at the guy and now I should be able to finish him off pretty easily because uh, his health is quite low uh, as you can see he's got a buff going on though and he can uh, reload uh, refill his health pretty easily and I killed him awesome nice I didn't I don't even know what happened there honestly um, I ran into him and I'm probably the gun might have given him a butt in his face or something but yeah maybe I can pull this back probably not but let's let's go back in and see as you can see yeah art style is supposed to be like in a high school kids um, drawing book kind of thing uh, whoa already already man oh damn damn okay only 93 um, I mean only 7% of health he took off so that's good Okay, that that was health um let's arm this thing again because it it worked really nicely last time um, i'm up here dude like i'm totally up here there we go and now that's gonna obliterate him again nicely done okay i think i feel cheeky with this move but um hey it worked right here we go i killed him again awesome <laughs> nice okay getting the hang of this now um let's see if we can actually come back and win this i apologize for the stuttery speech because um yeah trying to play a game that you're not good at while speaking uh not not the easiest thing in the world but uh here we go here we go now we have landed and let's let's try to do that move again where is he i am gonna so obliterate you here we go here we go here we go here we go come on yeah you've got to let that wrong thing pull up he has dealt a good set of damage to me so far ah and it, it goes down as well that's why i'm learning here now interesting i only have six percent so he is gonna kill me he's learning my moves ah damn it he got me he got me so uh the second uh, special attack that this character has is some kind of bat attack that i have failed so far to pull off at any point he had a drone i think the drone is what took me out at least in part anyhow we're gonna respawn here i think he will if he wins one more uh he wins because it's first to four i believe so let's see what happens here now i'm gonna try to do my bat attack thing uh, that's what i call it he spawned right near me and i think i hit him i think i hit him good uh did i i even touch him doesn't seem like it nope 
Um, let's try to try to aim at him here. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh damn! Kill me before I had a chance to kill him out. Damn it! And I think he won. Didn't he win? You lose. Yes. So I lost the brawl. Now um, you get keys, and there is a microtransaction system where you go and uh, so not using keys, using some kind of mystery box where you can buy them, and you get things like emotes and have a possibility of getting weapons and uh, skins and stuff like that. But yeah, I'm not really interested in that to be honest. And uh, yeah, I don't think there's any uh, any microtransactions that give you a big uh, game kind of advantage. But uh, let's go in. As you can see, I got some XP there and stuff. Mission 2. So there's missions you can get as well. Uh, what is this? Two stars until room 2. I'm not even sure what any of this is exactly. I guess you can unlock it as you go. And there's a lot of progression. Yeah. So, continue. Let's continue there. And uh, we are going to go have a look at the characters just for a second. Uh, there we go. That is uh, our character, and these are the different ones you can have. And each one has a sort of advantage over certain other character. And uh, each one has their own special attack, and there might be more as well hidden away. These are the ones that I have unlocked. So let's exit the lobby. I'm not going to try to do another game again because that's going to take like 20 minutes, like it did last time to get a new game. That was not fun. Uh, so yeah, um, let's go down to the loot and see that's the mystery box over there. So you can buy those. Uh, they had a special offer when you when you just start the game, like you get three for a dollar ninety nine. So yeah, it's not gonna be cheap and it's probably not gonna be fun. So yeah, you know, beware, I guess. Uh, you if you got the game for free on PS Plus, I don't know you can throw some money at them. But as you can see, yeah, it's not the cheapest thing. You can go and buy skins and weapons and uh, weapons. Hold on, skins, tons and weapons as well. Uh, Porsche's tons of weapons automatically get they won't launch weapons that require blood keys to unlock. Yeah, okay, okay So yeah, there's microtransactions. You can go and do some trainings here You can customize your taunts and your character and stuff like that um, You can check your character progress. So this is your character progress each character has their own progress and you can finish sort of little achievements to progress and then there's the ranked tower which we're trying to climb not doing so well so far here are the weapons the weapons are very interesting though that's one thing there's like a dodgeball then what oh i think uh that's a uh, guy yeah that is a character uh lucky bastard uh scorchy is that a character I'm not sure it could be like a pet or something or a side character but yeah, there's a JRPG and a JRPG used copy. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what any of those do. I haven't read through them, but as you can see, quite interesting, I'd say. So yeah, that's about it. What is this thing? There's a Sphinx. You have to go solve some keys of uh, some riddle of the Sphinx and you can get something. Not entirely sure. Again, the fight, we're just going to start a match just for the heck of it. Um, but yeah, this is going to have us waiting for about a half an hour, if not more. So that's the game. It's got a few game modes. Um, nothing extremely groundbreaking. I do like that it's just four player though that could lead to some more uh, refined gameplay and uh, more getting to know the level and your character and how to kind of fly around and land your hits so that's a good thing but for now I am gonna be calling it quits uh, thanks for watching like and subscribe if you want more until next time later